Holding hands before marriage is considered a sin in Islam. Muslims are not allowed to buy insurance. Non-alcoholic beer is still considered haram. <gasps> what is a sin? Yeah. <laughs> I think this is quite surprising. Hi guys, in today's Ask TSL, we're gonna have our non-Muslim colleagues ask some burning questions about Islam. Because like the topic of like religion is a bit sensitive, but it's healthy to have an open conversation about it. So let's go. Yeah. What are some you know questions that or some rules or do's and don'ts that you know about <laughs> Islam? Sometimes when Hafiz stay over my house, right? Is it okay that we? I heard that. You cannot listen to music excessively. Yeah, yeah. More uncommon. Yeah. That was my reaction when I first heard also, but I don't know if it's true and oh. I don't know why also. You saw online? Ah? No, so yeah, someone answer. told me. Then yeah. they just Who like tell you, then they like, yeah, they cannot answer why. Oh, they like, oh, yeah. by the way, cannot listen to music. Then you're like, why? <laughs> then they like, I don't they know. say cannot listen excessively because mm. you cannot overindulge. Oh. I don't know, man. Okay, I don't okay, know. Okay, okay, Excited okay. to learn more today. You Actions. cannot wipe your butt the same hand you used to. Ah, yeah, oh. I don't know what IG is. Oh, oh really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh really? No, but I thought it's like I think I heard from the left hand, right hand. Yeah, yeah, left hand, right hand rule. Right hand rule. You cannot wipe your butt with the hand that you used to eat. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, the first question: Eating with your left hand is a sin in Islam. Uh, oh, oh, yeah. oh. Uh, I thought it's more of like not which hand you use, but then it's which hand you use to eat and. Ah, oh, do, do your yeah. business. So it's not like left or right is wrong, but it's the act of using the hand to do the actions. Wow, I did not make sense there, right? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you're getting it. You're getting it. No, no, no. Yeah. As long as you separate right. lah, it's okay. Some of my Muslim friends got said before like cleanliness is very important. So I guess left hand is like for eating, then right hand is can be dirty. Right hand, right Okay, three, two, one. Oh yeah, 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 the answer varies so much. I'm saying it's not a sin. Oh, we are correct. Yay! Yeah. God damn! Okay, why? friends, if you were happy for the longest time and you didn't, <laughs> no, you never like say like accidentally like you left and oh I'm sinning. <laughs> <laughs> you never say like, hey, so how would I know? From my explanation is it's not macro. Macro is basically not encouraged, but it is a sunnah to eat with your right hand. Everything that you want to do that is good, you do with your right. So let's say you enter your house, you enter your right. Let's say you go toilet, you enter your left. Oh. Do people actually do that? The going toilet and going in the house? Who actually do it like it's like a norm already, man. So we yeah, don't actively yeah. like, like, eh, right, right, right first. I think it's also the same oh. concept as because like when you do something bad, then it's written on your left hand. Then the good deeds are written on your right hand. So it's like, oh. that is the practice. So to summarize, eating with your left hand is not a sin, but it's not encouraged. Yes. Mm. Because everyone is supposed to act or do as the prophet did. Mm. Right? Mm. So if you don't do what the prophet did, doesn't mean you sin. Ma. Mm. Oh, okay. uh. Holding hands before marriage is considered a sin in Islam. Mm. What if like the person gonna fall down? Uh, hold the person. Oh, that's a good one. Like, yeah. 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 Like, no thanks, they just let them fall. Holding hands. I think can, eh. I feel like in my vague memory, I do mm. see like couples holding hands, but I don't see them displaying affection publicly apart from holding hands. Yeah, yeah. Everyone say no? Yes. <gasps> what is a sin? In any relationship that isn't like a married couple, so that's like a non-halal relationship, right? You cannot have skinship in any forms. Oh. Even if that's not you said like, what if they fall down? That's accidental. So that's fine. Oh. But it's like, if you see them fall, then you don't like openly go and like, oh. want to go and hold their hand lah. If you're not like halal yet, right? A woman cannot be in contact with someone, a man who is like not mahram. Oh. Yeah. So mahram means, not your siblings, not your parents, uh. or not someone you are like already married to. Oh. So when you date, right? When you say you saw young couple, I, I think I don't know if I saw now. No, no, but especially in our community now, like in Singapore, it's quite common, ma, to see mm -hmm. couples they yeah. hold hands and all. But it's not right, lah, because okay. actually also when you like date without being married, you shouldn't be just like the two of you. 
you should be like chaperone or like that oh. for it to be a halal relationship. Oh. Because you have to date with the intention to marry. Oh, this is something new, eh? Yeah. I never heard of this before. So it's not just for relationships. It's also you know when it be like salam. Like I cannot salam just any man. Yeah, like that kind of thing also. It is haram for Muslim women to participate in modelling. True. Oh, oh my god. god. I think it's like straight up true. Yeah. Because I, I think recently I saw like this article yeah. and she's Muslim, then she modeled for it and then I think she got like a lot of like backlash mm. from it. I feel like if she's like appropriately covered, I'll imagine that to be okay. Yeah, like what if she's modeling for like modest way? Yeah, modest mm. way. Mm. Two opposing <laughs> opinions. Very sad, like always got different yeah, opinions. What's the answer? Interesting. It's not. Oh. Okay, but there's a very like but here, yeah. okay? okay? Because like in the context of we were saying like modest wear or like yeah. the other kind. Of course, if it's not for modest wear, like it's the fact that yeah, you're just not covering up. So that's of course wrong. Mm. But also aside from that, I think it's the fact of a woman putting herself out there and you're not supposed to do that because it's like you want to try to conceal as much evil eye from the public. Mm. And also it's not very modest for you to like flaunt. It's not actually like written, you know, where they're like, no, you cannot model because this is something that has come up over the years and yeah. of course the Quran came like so long back, right? Mm. So of course they don't have this written. You see the context. What you're modeling for and I think for modest way also it's like the way that you model right I think it has to be like more of a necessity rather than like your intention is because I want to model I want to be out there yeah oh. yeah so maybe it's a necessity because this person is selling and they want to like promote this like modest way yeah. I mean how else would you want to promote it right mm -hmm. yeah like that Muslims are not allowed to hang posters in their house okay. I think my answer would be like like uh. idols like the intention you know like wow <laughs> of, like putting something on too high a pedestal. Okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. Which I think then this yeah. one shouldn't be. Allowed. I also think it's not a lot because you shouldn't be idolizing anyone else other than the prophet. Have, have, have. Got it. So you say you've got a prophet there then Ken? Ken. Oh. That's what I think. Okay. Oh my God. It's no. all about the intention. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So you guys say not allowed. Yeah. 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 It's allowed. And it's exactly what Jewel said. Wow. It's the intention and what kind of poster. Huh, you're, you're correct yeah. about the <laughs> I don't. No, no, try. Uh, I'm wrong already. I'm really blaming myself <laughs> for this. But I'm yeah. willing to listen. <laughs> yes. There are other things that you can put up. For ah. example, paintings. Oh. Painting of the mountain. Oh, oh. But also on another note, right? It's not just like celebrities, mm. but it's also like animate objects. Like let's say you like graduate, right? Then got a lot of those graduate photos, the whole family behind. Technically, no. Mm. Um, they say when you put these kind of things up, angels won't enter your house. Oh, okay. So you won't okay. get blessings. Uh, this goes on to even like oh, it's like yeah. dolls. Oh, statues. Yeah. Yeah. Pop mat! Pop mat! But I think I like look, so <laughs> music is not permissible in Islam. Oh just you okay. I got asked! I got asked! I got asked! I got asked! But then you say your friend never tell you. I don't know why. I think it depends on the genre of the music and it's like a bit ambiguous. I like R and B. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. R and B is too sexy already. Maybe <laughs> 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 like those like, like metal, like yeah. hardcore, like ground, well, that kind of thing. Oh. But I have a different opinion oh, yeah. say, say, from say, say. what I've heard. If my friends are correct, if not, I will go and tell them. Okay. okay. <laughs> I heard that you can't listen to music in general because it's just the act of Zoning when out. you put on your headphones, you are immersed in another world, and you are not allowed to do that. Oh. You need to be always be present, present, present in the moment. Got Malay music, all yeah. That, right? yeah. And and it's like Malay pop music. There's not like religion related. So three, three two, two, one. one. Oh, I'm the only one. Uh oh. I feel like the lines are very blurred. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Oh. oh. Okay, oh. actually, no, no, but, but oh, you're on the right track. Yeah, you're on the right track. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> you're on the right track. I'm on the right okay. track, okay. But it's the but, ma, right? Yeah. It's true. Mm. But it's also because of like what your intention is with listening to the music. Oh. So, intention is like very big, right? So, maybe your intention is you play the music because you want to calm down. Oh, okay, lah. Oh. Like, cannot be, cannot, right? Oh, okay. It really is how you say like don't overdo it, mm. don't indulge in it too much mm. and then also your intention, yeah. That's okay, what I would okay. say. I would say the genre comes in quite a lot here because Just in case these genres have like something that lead you to a certain way, like to a certain path so that's why I try to avoid that lah. Arranged marriage is still quite common in 2023. 
I think so leh. I, oh, I think so. I feel like because some people are, are, are still quite like traditional. I think it just doesn't happen as often anymore, but it still exists. I think it's still common, but maybe the nuances of it has changed. Maybe For last example. time, the arranged marriage is legit like, you don't know each other. Mm-hmm. <laughs> then you all see the picture, your parents see, oh, love, right? Then <laughs> very good. But then now maybe it can be someone even closer to home, like family, friend. It's arranged in a sense where you all are put together to get to know each other more. They won't force y'all to get married straight away, but I still think ah, it's common. Okay, 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 yeah. okay, okay, okay. Fair, fair, fair. Answers. Answers. Yeah. Three, two, one. Yes. Change. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay, tell us. I think quite common in general, but mm. I want to address because you were saying that back in the days and now it's different, right? Actually, in like the practice of um, arranged marriages in Islam mm. is that it's never like also forced. Mm. Even back then, you still had a choice. Oh, you still so had a choice. choice yeah. So okay. even though it's arranged, both of them still will have to agree, agree oh. to this union. You're not getting married off to someone that you don't want to be with. Oh. Yeah. My parents were arranged marriage, so yeah. Oh. Yeah, because both my grandfathers work in the same place. And like, hey, you want to marry my son or your daughter? Like, <laughs> so, yeah, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Question is, Muslims are not allowed to buy insurance. Hmm. I would say can. A hey, wait. No, I think can. Okay, my sister is FA also. Then she got a lot of clients. Clients as many. Oh. Yeah, so probably in Singapore and our community, it's quite common for them to have insurance. Uh. Wow, my thought process is just everywhere wait, now. Wait, wait, why is it a thing though? Isn't insurance supposed to like protect you, act as a mm. safety net if anything happens? Mm. Mm. Okay. So I don't know what's wrong with that. Just a guess. Uh. Yeah. I really don't know. Uh. Maybe in their belief, they think that they don't need to buy an assurance if ah. they can like maybe take care of themselves or something. Then if you accident how? Yeah. <laughs> Shit, yeah. <laughs> I think it's somewhat linked to like the Muslims cannot put money in the bank something like that. Oh, really? No, can. Okay, no, no, no. no, no. There's something along those lines. Invest? Like, oh, yeah. It's like maybe linked to us like risk and like linked to like gambling, that kind of thing, which is not, not a lot. Like, I don't know. Uh, one, two, three. It sticks. Huh? Okay, in Singapore, let's use the Singapore context. Mm. So they also address this issue because they do understand that there is concerns of what happens when you don't have this safety net. The reason why we would say that it's like not allow because it really depends on what kind of insurance you buy. You guys were on the right track about like rates oh. and gambling, mm. like that kind of thing. That's why you have to really see the fine print and see what kind of insurance you're buying. Okay. And also the fact that when you buy life insurance, you don't want to earn from a tragedy. That kind oh, of thing. Oh my god. That makes wow. so much sense. You don't but, want to earn from yeah. tragedy. Okay. But there are like insurance that caters to ensure that it will follow the Islamic laws. Oh. So in Singapore, yeah. If it's, let me see some, uh, read the fine print now. Uh, yeah, so in general, I would say there are more that yes. cannot than can. Uh, uh, oh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Can. okay, last question. Non alcoholic beer is still considered haram. Ah, mm. eh, the hard eh, wow, special. Okay, I will quite easily gravitate towards. Uh, Yes, it's not a lot. Yeah. It's because it's the intention, ma. right? As in, so the intention is of beer is really negative. Doesn't mean you take mm. out the alcohol, then like suddenly now this thing that was pre- previously negative is now like uh-huh. okay. Okay, okay. But what if you're aware? Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I feel like my answer is it's allowed. Like the only thing like haram about it is the alcohol inside, is it? Yes. Yeah. So then to, like if you take alcohol and yeah. it's okay. So I think it's about like the awareness. Like if I'm aware that yeah. this drink has no alcohol in it, it's the same as I'm picking up like a gassy drink. Mm. So to me it's like, okay, there's no alcohol in it, I can have it. If I compare it to being vegetarian, mm. for example, mm. when you go to vegetarian zicha restaurants, mm. they do try to use ingredients to mimic like meat meat. So it's like, but vegetarians still eat it. Mm. So if we put the same idea, mm. the context here, mm. then it means that they shouldn't even be like making food that mimics meat. They should just be eating non-meat. Non- mm. yeah. Okay, I support her. Yeah, so I... This one is a hardest hard question. Wow, don't yeah. be scared. I listen so I like, oh, I also don't know what to go there. Yes. Yeah. That's what we mentioned. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Okay. He brought up a good point about intention. Wow. Wow. He brought the closest one here to marrying a Malay girl. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Actually, there was also a study that they did where they asked like, but it's not alcoholic, what? So why cannot drink? It's mm. the same as like drinking a normal drink. Mm. But then they say, okay, first of all, in terms of beer, not a lot of 
companies can even ensure that it's hundred percent non-alcoholic because oh. there, there might be like Trace. lingering, you know, yeah, traces of it. I don't know how to explain it in English, but we Malays use the term was was. Mm. The moment you are in that doubt, then don't do it. Don't la. do it. Oh, okay, that makes, yeah. yeah, makes sense. Now that we are done, mm-hmm. is there anything that like shocked you? I think I learned the most from the insurance question actually. Okay, because I think you said a very important line that will be etched in my mind forever. Oof, what is it? You shouldn't earn from tragedy. Mm. Wow mm. Yeah. That one like Kind of blew my mind I really yeah. didn't know I think same for me eh? Cause I feel like All the other ones Is like We all sort of like Know But we don't exactly Know what is the answer to it mm. Yeah I don't have a Specific question But I think My like biggest takeaway Of today is Intention Oh yeah <laughs> because, uh, I think based on Like what they have shared Right Most of it is based on Like your intention Of your action I also learned that I need to like Go and talk to my friends <laughs> <laughs> Who actually teaching me The wrong things <laughs> Yes. Thank you for watching this episode of Ask DSL. If you liked it, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Ring the notification bell and watch our other videos over there. Bye!